Hi, this is Sherry Veronica. What's in your news for Wednesday, the 21st day of February in the year 2024? Anthony Willoughby, he brought a point out, and I'm sure it wasn't the first time, where a female pointed out one person, but the Barbados Police Service produced another person. This is in the Neil Anthony Broom case, okay, and it resembles what happened to Derek Crawford you can go and pull up Derek Crawford and see that the people who were involved in a matter with Derek say nah nah it's not Derek it's not Derek it's someone else <coughs> excuse me it's someone else so it's something that happens in Barbados <coughs> excuse me please <laughs> So this is Sean Watson. The sentencing structure is being talked about and the DPP wants 35 years start point, 35 years. And his attorneys are saying 25 years. I talked about this on a separate video. Please have your say, okay? The ministry's outreach is targeting, well, not targeting, but it's being, they're pulling in um, beauty, salons and barber shops and they are working to have them understand workplace wellness and policies and that kind of stuff so it's something that is happening in bridgetown and it's beginning on friday somebody wants this to start removed holders hill full cry out digital aware of the concerns for some reason they want this particular tower to be gone you're talking about potholes here spending to go up i spoke about this under a separate video where if um you want to be on the stage you want to be noticed like me and motley says you're for a small island nation you're punching above your size so if you don't want the spending to go up it's gonna have to come out of your pocket you can't have it in your pocket and then talk about something going up it, it, it's life is like that <laughs> life is like that okay you're gonna have to spend more if you want to stabilize things going on on the ground floor lady st john is unhappy with thorn's move now she said that he called her up thorn ralph thorn called her up and asked her can i come over i need you to nominate me for this particular seat in the, in the b as in boy lp and she did it and you know she actually liked him after she read his book but she's in shock she's in shock that he made the move that he did what he did okay people disappoint you all the time lack of execution a concern for the caribbean development bank i spoke of that under a separate cover and i recommended that they use um, contractors to get work done because it's obvious that they don't trust local governments it's because of the, the the they're always watching and whatever rules they have in place they really exercise that to get um to make sure that nothing goes on the wrong side of the road okay they want everything to be done right i'm talking about the cdb and whatever structure they have in place they stick to it okay Okay, I guess um, these um, teachers will be back out there because remember St. Bartholomew, so if there are fewer complaints, I guess they'll feel free, teachers and students and parents will feel better sending their kids and teachers going back out and you know, whatever else is going to be back to normal soon, hopefully. They're saying almost 5,000 people apply for the welcome stamp. This is investing in the vulnerable. Okay, power sharing, best for parties. They're talking about the DLP. That's dominated your, your news. I think because he went to the DLP, D as in damage, <laughs> the DLP, he went there and they were saying i read somewhere in your paper where this they said that because there was no 
um, showing no one won that certain funds that would have been available were not because it was 0 30 or 30 0 and now that he has gone to the DLP those funds would have opened up that's what they're saying I don't know if it's fully opened up just because of one person or if it's partially opened up you could you could find out more about that designer Suzanne's career all sewn up a free movement yeah they were talking about free movement in the Caribbean so that um, people can work in other parts of the Caribbean and also they were talk this talk about minimum wage yeah that was big on the agenda People are saying that this is easier said than done when Airbrons urged Beijing to capitalize on provision. And there was someone else in there talking about capitalizing on things that are going on that the Mia Motley administration is putting in place. And people were saying that that's easier said than done, but you have to apply yourself. You do have to apply. Nothing is going to drop in your lap. Okay, nothing is going to drop in your lap. You have to apply yourself. Husband, husbands outlines benefits of trade blocks. Okay. Oh yeah, I, I included this for this reason, for this one here. This lady is worried about her future you know, because she's been with a guy for 21 years and she's saying that when, if he if he goes before her, he has children and she he's saying, oh, I have you set, I have you organized in my will, but she has not seen the will and she's asking Christine, you know, what she should do. And Christine's telling her, you should ask him for a copy of the will. But when I, when I think about it and I say to myself, well, if she's worried, and if he's not really openly telling her, well, here it is, you know, see, it's right here. And, you know, giving her a copy and something is up. She doesn't trust him. And if something is up, I don't, I think they're married or they're together for 20. I don't think you can disinherit a wife. Well, not here in the States. You can't disinherit someone that's been with you for that long. But if she's worried about the will part of it, that means that she doesn't trust him. Okay, and if and she's afraid to ask, she's actually afraid to ask him. Will show me the will, and if it is at that point where she is afraid to even ask him to show her the will, that means that if he were to show her a will, who's to say that's the most updated one? Who's to say that after he shows her a will, that he doesn't change it to say something else, and when she goes, she's still out of luck. You know, trust goes a long way respect goes a long way lack of execution a concern for the cdb i think i talked about this before yeah i think i talked about that before okay he's still absent from the table investigations are still ongoing with him that's jean leon there was a problem yesterday in uh, on flamboyant avenue in St. James where the trees and the wires, the electrical wires were touching and um, the Barbados Lightning Power came out and I think they remedied some of it but there's still more to be done, okay? So um, I'm reporting on that. There's still more to be done in that area where the trees and the electrical wires are touching. This is the big bill. I think I talked about that earlier. Maybe I didn't. Where people are talking about the big bill. And I, I talked about this under a separate video. Where I say people should pay a minimum fee to, to present themselves at the hospital. And students should pay, 50, should be subsidized 50%. You, you want to go back to school? You want to learn? Okay, we'll subsidize your education. But it should not be 100% free. Okay? And this is talking about barely minimum and I talked about that under a separate cover where I I suggested that the minimum wage should be $20 an hour that's minimum because of all the tourists that Shelly Williams says they are coming that are coming to the island because of Mia Motley doing everything that she does with the general with the central bank governor general saying that Barbados is pretty stable financially yeah I think that it should be 
nothing. It should be, it should be an honor. It should be an honor for the Barbadian workers to get twenty dollars minimum wage when they go to anywhere to find a job. Minimum wage, twenty dollars an hour. That's what was in your news. I will be back tomorrow, the twenty second. Tomorrow is Thursday, and if all goes well. I will see you and talk to you tomorrow. Have a beautiful Wednesday. Hum there. <laughs> this is Sherry Veronica. Help me spread the word about Naked Departure via social media. Subscribe and share to show support and love for our channels.